In this tutorial, you will learn how to install an Arduino library using the library manager on the Arduino IDE. So we will see how to install a library, how to remove it, and also how to change between different versions. So first of all, go to Tools and then Manage Libraries. You will get this uh, window here and you can see on the bottom updating list. So that will check for updates for your uh, current libraries that you have installed. So here you can see we have many, many, many different uh, libraries. So if you go here, you have all and then you can do install to see the installed library that you already have. So you can see you already have quite a few libraries actually. OK, and let's go down and you can see, for example, we have servo and stepper, okay, which are the libraries you can use to uh, control servo motors and stepper motors. So those are actually installed, okay? So all those libraries are already installed when you install the Arduino IDE. Now let's go back to the normal view. We are going to install a new library from this library manager here. So what you can do, because the list is very long, what you can do is simply search here on this search bar and I'm going to search for IR remote. So I'm going to use this library as an example. Okay, we are not going to use it. It's just to see how to install libraries. And the library we want is that one, IR remote. So here you have, so you can choose the versions. Okay, we are going to uh, check that later and you can just uh, click on install, okay? If you click on install, that's going to install the latest available version. So now you can see here installed. Right, so now that the library is installed, we can actually uh, use it. And to be able to check if you can use the library, well, you can just try to include the library. So include like this, and then irremote.h. So how to know what header to use well, that should be in the documentation of your library. Here, I already know it. So it's ir uppercase and then remote lowercase dot h. So now if I'm not going to upload, I'm just going to verify the code. Let's name it ir remote test. Okay, down compile. So when you just uh, verify here, it will compile the code and try to find that library. So here, it's working, we have the library and we can use it in our program. So you know how to install a library, know how to remove that library. Well, to remove the library, you have to go to the folder where it is installed. And this is not hard to find. You can go to File, Preferences, and you will see your sketchbook location here. That is where your Arduino programs will be stored and also your libraries. So now you can go to this folder. So I have opened a file manager and I am in, so document, Arduino libraries, so the document of my uh, user here. And in libraries, you can see, so we have a readme.txt, right, containing some information. And now we have a package here. We have a new folder, IR remote. So the library was installed right there. Okay, this Arduino is where you have all your sketches, all your programs, and then you have a folder named libraries. And here is where you get all the libraries that you are going to install on top of the ones that already exist. So what if I want to remove or uninstall the library? Well, that's really super simple. You just remove the folder and that's it. And now if I try to rerun, so just compile the code again, you can see we have this error. So fatal error, no such file or directory here. And you can see, see, no such file or directory. If you have this error, it means that either you have not installed the library or you have made a typo in the name of the header. Right, so now what I can do is go back to tools, manage libraries, go back to the library manager. Okay, updating list here. So all the sources are updated correctly, so we can have the latest versions. I'm going to go back to IR remote. And now you can see here, it's not installed anymore. I can install it again. 
And if you want to change the version, so let's say I install the latest version, okay. Now it's installed, I click on this. And now you can see I have different versions. So the latest is here 3.0.3, uh, so that may be different for you, of course. Let's say I want to go back to version 2.5.0, for example. Okay, in that case, I just choose the version here. I just click on install. And now you can see the version is 2.5.0. So that can be useful, for example, if you work on a project that already exists and this project is only compatible with a certain version of the library. So in that case, you have to use also the version of that library and you have to install the correct version. Or if you find that, for example, the newest version is actually not that stable and is breaking a lot of things, you may want to go to a previous version so you have a stable uh, version to work with. So here 2.5.0, you can go back to any version if you want to. And you can see we have an update button. So whenever you don't install the latest version, if you click on update, that's going to install the latest version here. And we go back to 3.0.3. All right, and now well, things are working correctly. And if we go back to our uh, file manager, we still have the IR remote here. And well, so now you know how to install an Arduino library with the library manager. You know how to remove that library and you know how to install different versions of that library. If you liked this video, subscribe to get more tutorials like this in the future. Also, check out my online courses so you can learn Arduino step by step in an efficient way by practicing and directly going to the point. Links in the description. All right, thank you for watching. See you in the next tutorial or in one of my courses.